I found it really difficult, obviously through four ACLs, it's back to back to back to back rehabs and um, a usual ACL is nine months and so to do nine months worth of training and work and then in one game back for it all to go and um, it's pretty hard mentally I guess to get your head around and to have that keep happening, I mean I guess for anyone to go through that you'd have to go through some sort of depression and I certainly did and it was something that was an incredible battle for me but um, I never wanted to give up and never thought about giving up but at the same time I'd be lying if I said it wasn't difficult and so coming back from the four um, once I actually got back I guess and my physio and my family they all said it to me you've got to actually take a moment to be really proud of what we've achieved and um, I say we because it's such a, a team effort there's no way you can get through this on your own and um, I had so many pivotal people that helped me through it and went through some difficult times but I'm so proud of where we've got to now and I feel like I have a real opportunity now to help other people go through what I was really struggling with as well. I had a lot of people contact me and it probably took me three months to really get back to a lot of messages and um, a lot of them were I've done one ACL or two ACLs, what's your sort of advice and I wrote back to all of them because you, you feel the empathy and you understand what they're going through but I also had a, I did, I probably had a light bulb moment where I thought, well, why don't, why don't I come up with something where rather than replying to every single person um, and giving them a personalised message where it's a little bit different but the concept's the same, why don't I come up with something where I can just refer everyone to the same thing? And so from there I decided um, to do a website. Uh, I've got a bit of information on there that will hopefully help people. So it's MTMF, it's Mental Toughness, Mental Fortitude. It's a slogan that I come up with about three years ago um, for a couple of reasons. One, to help me through my rehab and uh, to remind me obviously of what I've been through and how far I've come and um, to obviously keep going. But secondly, it was also through the support and the messages I got. And, Every time I've read these messages, um, it made you just think oh, there's no way I'm not going to overcome this and I've just had, had that much support. And so I sort of come up with that slogan and I've worn it on my wristband um, ever since and it's something that I look down at and just reminds me of exactly where I am and um, what I want to achieve. And it obviously has that sentimental value behind it too and um, for me that's just been a massive learning curve as well. So um, something that I'll just wait and see how that, how that takes off.